Halo teman-teman semuanya, selamat datang lagi di UJ Story Channel Kita lanjutkan lagi gameplay Sherlock Holmes Dan terakhir kita berhasil memecahkan teka-teki siapa pembunuh dari tetangga masa kecilnya si Sherlock Yaitu si Gilden ya teman-teman ya Yang dibunuh oleh gajahnya sendiri yang ditrigger oleh rekan kerjanya ternyata Nah di akhir episode kemarin kita dapat uh, seperti cuplikan teman-teman ya kalau si Sherlock teringat dengan sesuatu di masa kecilnya di rumahnya, kita balik ke rumah lagi. Kita lihat apa yang terjadi di sini, teman-teman. Ya, fragmented memory. You know, I envy you, Sherry. You can talk to other people and they won't ignore you. And I envy you. You can ignore any person you're bored with. Ini. You don't miss out on much. Most men are dull, unlike yourself. Okay. Well, I'm flattered. Ini adalah lokasinya, guys. Ya, kita bakal ngecek. Berarti, oh, iya, iya, iya. Lokasi di gambar ini, teman-teman. Ya. I had a surprise for my mother. Okay, dia ada surprise untuk ibundanya katanya. I was holding an ancient Greek vase. Oh. You had a shovel with you, John. I remember now. Okay. We dug up the vase from Greek ruins here on Cordona, and were eager to show my mother right away. Oh, okay. Mereka berhasil mendapatkan harta karun ya katanya. Okay. For some reason, the door was closed. We knocked. Kita ketok, tok, tok, tok. But nobody answered. We thought that she was busy. So we left the vase and ran downstairs. Okay, mereka taruh vase di situ, mereka turun ke bawah. Okay. I decided to gather some archaeological tools in order to take a closer look at the vase. Mm -hmm. Then we heard something, didn't we? Ooh, ada suara ibunya dan suara vase jatuh, guys. Yes. It came from upstairs. Okay, apa yang terjadi? Oh, vase-nya pecah ya? The vase was broken, shards scattered all over the floor, and your mother was standing at the door. Okay. Indeed, John. I doubt it was her. Okay. Let me concentrate. Siapa? Dia ragu ya ibunya yang ada di sana. Oh, lagi lagi. Otto Richter was standing Otto Richter. there, furious at us. Doctor Richter told us never to disturb my mother when the door is closed. He said she had broken the vase. Hmm? But we didn't believe him. I bet he smashed it. Oh iya, bisa jadi ya yang mecahin itu si dokter Otto Richter. Oke. Okay. Jadi ngapain dokternya di kamar ibunya? The things are still here. Presumably Mycroft never felt the need to sort through it all. Or couldn't bring himself to. No. He would have put it behind him and moved on. My brother is not one for sentimentality. <laughs> si Mycroft kakaknya itu gak sentimental lah. Dia itu gak baper orangnya. Jadi uh, barang... Kita ada orang yang sentimen ya. Barang yang dari masa kecil kita simpen. Ada orang yang kayak alah gak penting dibuang gitu ya. <laughs> Abangnya kayak gitu. Nah, kita ketemu nih ruangan di mana ibunya tinggal. Kita bakal cek ya, guys. Oke, okay, ada yang bisa kita lihat di sini? Ada lukisan. Oke, okay. udah rusak. Kemudian ada. This room always reeked with an acrid medicinal stench. And here is the reason. Jangan-jangan ibunya itu farmasis ya, teman-teman ya? Dia banyak obat loh. Oke, okay, ini ada lagi. Wow, apa ini? Ada surat di sini teman ya. Old sheet of paper ya. Tulisan dari Dr. Octoriter ya. Oke. Okay. Beberapa bulan lalu aku minta Mr. Mrs. Holmes untuk sketsa landscape. Oke, okay. jadi dia minta tolong sama si mamanya si Holmes, mamanya si Sherlock untuk melukis gitu loh ceritanya. Seeger Holmes Obituary in the Times. Oke, okay. Seeger Holmes ini kayak papanya teman-teman ya. Oh, papanya si Sherlock ini arkeolog, teman-teman. Meninggal dunia di usia 41 tahun karena cardiac event. Jantung ya, teman-teman ya. Wah. Oke, okay, oke. Okay. Hmm. Jadi, ketika papanya meninggal, si Sherlock umur 6 tahun, teman-teman ya. Sedih juga sih. It's a strange feeling to read about my father's death in the newspaper. I can't recall anything except The deep feeling of loss. Yeah. You were too young. It happened before we even met. It's so sad. I'm sorry. Okay, ini ada satu lagi guys. Oh, ini sketsa yang dimaksud ya. Jadi si. This picture was drawn by my mother. I oh, recognize oh. her hand. There's a date on it, 8th of December, 1868. Jadi si Richter suruh mamanya lukis ya. Ini lukisan mamanya guys ya. Lukisan landscape mamanya. This seems a bit odd. I can recognize my mother's style, but it's far too sloppy. Dated 12th of February 1869. Oke, okay, beda beda tanggal ya. Ini ada satu lagi nih. Makin hancur gambarnya. It's difficult to tell what this is meant to represent. There's no date at all. 
Jangan-jangan dia kena Alzheimer teman-teman ya. Gua nggak tahu apa yang terjadi. Yang pasti kemampuan ibunya semakin menurun seiring berjalannya waktu. Oke, ini apa? Straps on the bed. Oh, oke. Okay. Just doesn't look right. Um, kenapa ibunya diikat di tempat tidur? Mencurigakan teman-teman ya. Jangan-jangan ibunya juga gangguan jiwa. Mungkin dia skizo ya, makanya dia bisa lihat temannya juga. Dia ada gangguan jiwa juga si Sherlock ini. Mungkin keturunan dari ibunya. Hmm. Potasium bromet KBR guys, KBR. <laughs> okay. One dram dissolved in a glass of water administered daily, not to exceed one dose in 24 hours, not to be given to children. Tidak untuk anak kecil ya. Ini harusnya bisa diambil guys. One dram dissolved in a glass of water administered daily, not to exceed one dose in 24 okay. hours, not to be given to children. Harusnya bisa diambil nih. Seems this was the most frequently used medication. Oke. Okay. Satu di sana, kemudian apa lagi? Oke, ada laci di sini. Oh, di dalamnya ada surat, teman-teman. Surat apakah itu? My gentle seeger. Oke, ini kayaknya surat dari mamanya si Sherlock untuk suaminya, teman-teman ya. Dia bilang kalau anak-anaknya udah kangen gitu ya, disuruh suaminya untuk kembali ke Cordona. Kayaknya suaminya itu kerja di luar kota gitu lah, teman-teman ya. Sedih juga sih. Jaman dulu nggak ada HP ya. <laughs> Oh, Jangan disamain sama sekarang. Right Not this one. Surface corrosion suggests it was prone to extreme temperature fluctuations. For medical purposes, I suppose. Oke, ini ada satu lagi, guys. Ada koper di sini kita bakal coba buka. Kok oh, suaranya serem? Mau oh, apa ini, teman? Apa itu? Kayak alat cukur, guys. Oke, ada diari di sini tuh nih. Oke, observation of Miss Holmes. By Octorictor, jadi uh, dia mengobservasi Miss Holmes ya, ya. dia melihat kemamp uh, apa namanya penyakit dia apa yang terjadi padanya ya. Dia kasih dia sedatif ya, kayak penenang gitu ya, obat penenang untuk meminimalisir uh, anxiety apa ya, anxiety kayak cemas gitu teman-teman ya, kecemasan ya. Kayaknya ibundanya itu ada gangguan kecemasan gitu, dan dia bisa uh, agresif tiba-tiba gitu loh ya. Ngeri sih. Gangguan mental tuh paling ngeri, guys. Kita tuh nggak bisa merasakannya. No labels. I don't ever had one. Oke, kita lihat apa sini. There appear to be residues of the bottle's contents at the bottom. Oke, kita ambil. Brings back some memories. Oke, eh sorry, ada beres. Jadi orang gangguan mental itu health issue itu paling ngeri di dunia menurut gue ya. Penyakit yang mengerikan banget lah. Oke, ini satu lagi nih, guys. Look what I found. The White King is under attack. Sherry, can you save him and checkmate the opponent in one move? Okay, kita suru main catur bentar ya guys ya. Gue bakal coba melihat. Nah ini dia. Dia menantang gue untuk main catur. Kita cari mana ya? Mana yang bisa gue pakai? Defend the King with Bishop. Save the King by retreating. Kalau mau ngecek mid harus ditutup pakai Bishop lah. Ya. Oh, nice move. Check mid pun. You save the King and checkmate the Black King with the Rook. Gua nggak pinter main catur ya, <laughs> teman gue pinter main catur gue nggak. Oke, okay, sebenarnya kita bakal cek lagi misinya di sini. Nah, di sini ada gambar kimia, artinya kita harus nyari tahu tentang komponen dari substansi substansi uh, apa ya? Komponen zatnya itu apa isinya teman? Kita coba chemical analysis ya. Jadi Sherlock ini ada talenta dalam uh, mengetahui kandungan dari botol tadi teman ini nggak ada labelnya. Tiga merah, tiga minus tiga hijau, berarti tiga merah minus lima tambah dua. Okey, ini doang gampang. Berarti ini plus ini, ini ke sini dan sini. Okey, tiga merah minus tiga hijau. Confirm. Sukses, teman-teman ya, cukup gampang. Oh, jadi diterima hasilnya adalah sebuah halusinogen yang direvise dari mushroom. Jadi kalau kalian tahu ada spesies jamur yang bisa bikin Halusinasi teman-teman ya, gue nggak tahu nama spesiesnya, cuman gue pernah ngeliat teman gue mengkonsumsi itu di tempat wisata biasanya ada yang jual, cuman itu ilegal biasanya ya, dan itu tidak adiktif untungnya ya. Jadi tergantung mood yang make ya. Misalnya kalau yang make moodnya jelek dia bakal makin sedih, kalau dia lagi senang dia bakal ketawa kayak orang gila. Gue nggak saran pakai hal semacam itu sih ya teman-teman ya. Okay, di sini after examining my mother's room, I started remembering chaotic, chaotic morning together. Okay, dia udah mulai uh, mengingat kembali apa yang terjadi ya di sini ya. Oke, okay, kita bakal coba lihat ya apa yang terjadi di sini. Nah, ada ingatan baru teman-teman di sini. 
ada kaca yang pecah uh, piring all over the floor Minecraft had to change his suit as the one he was wearing was mother was troubled that morning something we did upset her okay Dr Richter tried to calm her down okay apa lagi di sini We had to put the tray with mother's morning tea down but why It's starting to ring a bell I think it happened in the morning okay dia teringat kembali wow oke okay. kita bisa meng ini teman ya morning mania oke okay. jadi eh uh... mamanya itu kayaknya ini teman ya oke okay, teman-teman ya jadi bang aja udah bahasa ini di sini uh, ibunya itu dalam kondisi upset atau sebel gitu ya ditenangkan oleh dokter Richter kemudian Mycroft harus mengganti baju karena kena bajunya kena makanan teman-teman ya dan si bocil itu taruh morning tea di situ teman-teman ya jadi kalau gua lihat posisinya kayaknya kayak gini ya teman-teman ya jadi piringnya kena si Mycroft gitu kan kita coba ya validasi ya tor betul oke okay. Liars, get away from me! It's not true. It's not real. What? Oh. Nah, itu Oke, okay, kita teringat kembali ya dengan masa kecil. It was the anxious. Ah, gue susah banget ngomong bahasa ini sih jadinya sok bule banget gua. Apa namanya ya? Gelisa teman-teman ya dan historical. Oke, okay, dia melempar makanan dan meneriaki dokter segala macam. Oke. Okay. My, my she, she was not just ill, but... Hari dia meninggal ya. Had. I'd have mercy. I'm sorry. That explains why you locked the memory away. There must be more, John. I, that was the morning of her death. I need to know what happened. John. John. Every time you I, I just don't Please, Sherry, leave it be. Just breathe, John. You know that I cannot leave the last stone unturned. We are so close. I... I know. But can we at least leave it for another day? Okay. Um, we need to continue, misalnya, ya. Coba ya. It cannot wait. Let us find another door and finally learn the truth. That's pointless, Sherry. To date, you have had no control over the return of these memories. It is all triggered by your work elsewhere on Cordona. You must accept that this will have to wait. Are you all right? I'm all right. In the end, little has changed. My mother was still unwell, just not with tuberculosis. Okay. What I do not yet understand is why Mycroft lied about it. There are precious few pieces of this puzzle remaining, John. Let us dawdle here no longer. Indeed. Wait. Did you hear that? Yes. Metallic souls. What is this sailor doing here? Oke, okay, ada yang datang, guys ya. Jadi dia masih penasaran kenapa Mycroft berbohong tentang TBC. Karena ibunya mati bukan karena TBC. Menurut gue ibunya gangguan jiwa sih sebenarnya. Ada hubungan dengan kejiwaan. Oke, okay, ada orang yang datang ke rumah kita. Sherlock Holmes, isn't it? Oke. Okay. Greetings. With whom do I have the pleasure of speaking? You can call me your new game. The rules are simple. I have something for you, but you alone must work out what that is. And that something is my prize, I suppose. You're a fast learner, sir. Oke, okay, kita observasi dia ya, kita lihat ya. Dia kasih kita permainan tiba-tiba random banget. Oke, okay, kita lihat. Ada pink paint in here, ada cat di kepalanya, kemudian bajunya sedikit kotor ya. Kemudian tangannya juga bukan pekerja keras ya dia ya. Nggak ada kerja fisik ya. Menyembunyikan sesuatu di dalam ini ya. Oke, okay. apakah dia sailor artist atau artist disguise as sailor? Iya, dia adalah artis ya menurut gue ya. Dia seorang uh, pe, pe, pera, pengrajin tapi pura-pura jadi sailor ya. Karena dia itu nggak ada fisik sebagai seorang sailor teman-teman. Kita bakal confirm. Oke. Okay. I cannot believe that Mr. Vogel has somehow successfully called my attention to his gallery. You're here with an invitation to visit it, obviously. My word, you are fast, Mr. Holmes. Could you explain how you came to that conclusion? Of course. Explanations are my favorite part of any conversation. 
hands without any sign of regular physical activity in contradiction to one who would most usually wear such a uniform. The paint in your hair is pink. I don't know of any military service that paints their ships <laughs> pink unless they have launched a new fashionable fleet. A sailor with the soul of an artist? I would suggest rather a gallery employee disguised as a sailor to mislead me. How many artists on the island know where I live and of my passion for deduction? Werner Vogel is clearly at the top of the list. And you've been attempting to conceal something square-shaped within your pocket. An invitation, I suppose. An invitation to Mr. Vogel's gallery. That was remarkable, Mr. Wow. Holmes. Mr. Vogel was right about your genius. I think he may have even underestimated you. This is your invitation. Okay. Please tell Mr. Vogel that the seed has been planted. He asked me to tell you to do so. If you win this little game, farewell. Okay, kita berhasil memenangkan ya. Kita diundang kepad uh, oleh orang yang pergi ke pemakaman ibunya si Sherlock. Kalau kalian ingat ya, yang gambar-gambar lukisan itu teman-teman. Ya. Mr. Vogel ya, untuk ke uh, galerinya dia teman-teman ya. Kita dapat misi baru di sini. Nah, kita bakal pergi ke Caravanserai di Crossroad of Bazaar Road dan Hermes Avenue di Old City. Oke, okay, kita bakal ke Old City teman-teman ya. Old City ini di sini Bazaar Road eh uh, mana bazar bazar kita nyari lokasinya teman-teman ya. Hmm, mata gua tidak melihat bazar. Oke okay, ini dia. Ini dia. Di sini teman-teman ya lokasinya ya. Kita bakal ke TKP, kita teleport aja langsung. Terima kasih atas undangannya. Biasanya kayak gitu ya. Kita nggak bisa langsung nyelesain misinya si Sherlock yang pertama yaitu yang ini guys ya. Yang Mother's Love ya. Kenapa? Karena yang Mother's Love ini bakal uh, jadi misi terakhir sih feeling gua. Karena kita tujuan utamanya memang mencari tahu tentang kematian ibunya. Cuman uh, seiring perjalanannya si Sherlock kita selalu ada hal samping yang datang gitu ya. Oke teman-teman kita menuju ke TKP langsung ya. Jalannya ada di sini. Galerinya. Ini kah lokasinya? SD kita baby. <laughs> Oke, okay. kayaknya di sekitar sini sih. Nah, kita sampai nih. Gul Afsar Kas ini dia. Gul Afsar Karavan Serai ini kali guys ya. Oke, okay, kayaknya ini lokasinya. Hmm. Ini art galerinya dia kah? Wih, betul teman-teman ya. Ini dia si Vogel. Mr. Holmes, you came. Oh, how kind. Though now of course I realize it is because of my game, not the works on display. It needn't be one or the other. Your man's disguise was easily debunked, Mr. Vogel, but I shall admit that you planted in me the seed of curiosity. Ah, terrific! I had no doubt you'd put the pieces together. Let us call it an opening gambit before the real game begins. So, this little game of yours, what's it about? An enigma to solve. A locked area in the basement with no windows found brutally vandalized. I have no clue how it was possible. Describe the events. Dia minta kita What about dunia. this intrusion? What happened? Last night, I was about to leave the gallery when I heard a noise downstairs. I went to the basement, but I didn't see anything out of the ordinary. It was admittedly a rudimentary inspection. It is not uncommon to get rats down there, so seeing nothing of note, I left and locked up the building. When I returned this morning, alas, I discovered that part of the exhibition had been torched, and there was no sign of the intruder. The mystery being, of course, that all the doors to the gallery were locked exactly as I left them. And the door to the basement is the only entrance. Correct. Tell me you're not intrigued. Okay. Di mana basementnya? And this locked area downstairs, what exactly was it? The under gallery. It's always shut and I'm the only one with the key. Ah, so this is your private collection, not part of the gallery. Oh no. It's an exclusive exhibition of eccentric pieces. Only a select cadre of artists, investors, and collectors are admitted. Not everyone deserves to have their eyes open. Well, this matter is certainly within my wheelhouse. This intrusion troubles me. Please take a look around if you're willing. The under gallery is through the door at the end. I okay. will see what I see. Okay. Kita bakal coba cari tahu tentang apa yang terjadi, teman-teman. Kita membantu dia ya. Dia bilang underground galerinya ada di pojokan. Gua gak tau di mana ya. You sure you don't like art, Sherry? Di mana di mana underground galerinya? Ini ketutup semua, Bos. Ini pintu keluar. Eh, uh, bentar ya, temennya. Kita coba lihat ya case-nya ya. Ini dia, case barunya. Oke. Okay. 
underground di sini kali ya. Ini dia guys. Back home we've got a taxidermist. He's gonna have a heart attack when he sees what I bring him. Ooh. Ini under galerinya dia ya. Serem banget coy. Kayak pengujian setan gitu guys. Wih, lihat nih. Ada burung gagak di sini. Sherry, how about some company in that dreary chamber yeah. of yours? Leave my loneliness unbroken, John. Ini kenapa nggak bisa diinspek? Oh, harus di queue ya. Oke, okay, bergerak sedikit guys ya ini ya katanya ya. Kita lihat lagi ada lagi nggak bisa di uh, scan? Oh itu dia. Ada tangan dulu di sini. A handprint oh. of a thing from another world. Plus it looks fresh and its coal origin ruins the effect of the extra mundane. Gua ngerti. Orangnya sembunyi di dalam uh, sini teman ya. Mungkin orang yang merusak ini sembunyi di dalam peti mati ini teman ya. Sodden and mold ridden. One presumes deliberately. Hmm, keren banget. Oh ini yang terbakar guys ruangannya. Oke kita coba cek ya. Oh ada puntung rokok di sana. The frame is empty. Oh, sheer vandalism. Only an ignorant person could do such a thing. Cold okay. fingerprints. I think we're looking for a man with a cold mustache. Oke. Okay. A mouth power bot. Oke okay, kita dapat clue lagi. Rokok yang dia gunakan dan dia itu banyak kol ya di tangannya ya kol itu um, arang dulu ya oke ada apa lagi di sini the chain is free oke okay. oh paintingnya diambil ya jadi ada painting yang dicuri sepertinya hmm oke okay. oke okay, nggak ada kelu di sini Oh ini ada kelu teman ya. Oh ada jamur-jamuran di sini. Parasites of creativity, or just a reflection of the artist's recreational Ooh. interests. Saturn devouring his son. Saturn. Okay. Grim composition. I'm flinching in its ferocity, yet somehow menarik, 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 beautiful. Menarik. Ini belum ya Franco Rom. Franco apa nih Mobile Legend nih guys. Oke okay, ada barang di sana. Oh ini ada. Hmm, menarik sekali. Uh, ada tanda panah. Ukurannya ini ukuran kakinya. 28. Okay. Hmm, oke. Okay. Jadi dia uh, jarak langkahnya itu berbeda, guys ya. Menarik ya. Old and hasn't been used for a long time. Oke. Kita mendapatkan beberapa clue di sini ya. Mungkin bisa kita pecahkan. Oke, okay, ada satu lagi kita belum buka. Close with a metal bolt. Eh salah mencet sorry Kaget loh Kok ada langkah kaki Oh dia masuk lewat sini Jangan-jangan guys Oke ada yang lecet di sini Scratches Fresh Magnet feeling Ada langkah kaki di sini Footprints Size Kakinya Nine and a half Oke dia sembunyi di sini Jangan-jangan Hmm Oke kita bisa membuat sketsanya Teman-teman ya Nice Nice Ini menarik sih Oke kita bisa meng Uh, membuat ilustrasinya temen ya hmm. Feeling gue ada yang keluar dari sini sih Nah ini udah pasti sih Kemudian uh, Yang di sini, Tunggu tunggu Yang sini apa ya Nah ada yang keluar dari sini guys Ya kan betul kan Ada yang keluar dari sini Kemudian sembunyi di sini, Ya kan Kemudian yang ini apa ya guys Ini gak ada pilihannya guys Oh bisa bisa pilih ya Nah, ini si bapak ini liatin ya yang di atas ya, teman-teman ya. Yang si Vogel ya. Nah, ini di Ini nggak mungkin dibakar dia karena ambil rokok di, di lempar puntungnya sih. Enggak mungkin. Oh, bisa jadi ya yang ngebakar si itu ya. Tunggu, tunggu, tunggu. Ini menarik sih. Kita coba lihat guys ya. Di sini ya, klunya ya. Oke. Okay. Oke. Okay. Oke. Okay. Jadi kemungkinan di Franco Room itu kayak gini ya. Kita lihat dulu ya temen ya Ada berapa pilihan Gak mungkin ini Karena itu kaki ya Berarti ini ya Ada orang sembunyi di situ ya Oh ini chimney Oke okay, gue ngerti ya Ada yang masuk dari ini guys Cerobong asap ya Kemudian uh, di sana dia Tangan dan kakinya kena Coal atau kena arang Dia masuk ke sini ketika bapak ini ngeliat temen ya dia sembunyi Kemudian di sini 
dia mencoba mengambil dari sana terus sebagian dibakar sama dia. Oke, okay, kita coba ya validasi ya. Benar enggak? Benar. Wuh, langsung the basement through the coal chute. He used a magnet to open the hatch bolt. He accidentally oh, pushed a shovel to the floor. Oke. Okay. Vogel heard the noise. At the sound of his approaching footsteps, the intruder hid inside the coffin. Oke. Okay. When Vogel entered the basement, he failed to notice anything strange and left without properly checking. The intruder waited until Vogel had left the caravanserai before burning the paintings in Wilde's room. But the vandalism was a cover for the theft. Pencurian karya seni. Oke. Okay. Kita menemukan clue baru di sini kita bisa ngajak ngobrol si Um, Vogel ya teman-teman ya kalau gitu ya kita bisa ngasih tahu dia kalau sebenarnya ini bukanlah vandalisme ya bukan menghancurkan tapi pencurian teman-teman ya oke okay. the pieces are not what i expected what do you think my collection is about it's about dozens of priceless works amassed simply for the sake of it and presented without care it's not about the art it's about excess yes I don't know. Well, that's absurd. Of course you know. It's your gallery. There is no one answer, no singular truth, but many filtered through the subjective mind. That Zaka? forgetting, embellishing, lying machine. Besides, what's wrong with a lie if it makes life more interesting? What's wrong with a lie? It corrupts the ability of others to behave freely and rationally. Men never act freely and rationally anyway. It matters not what is or isn't in the end. The only important thing is how you feel. And I simply want to feel and consume as much as I can. Don't you? Feelings are simply one's animal ancestry trying to wrest back control of the brain. I try to avoid the distraction. <laughs> you try not to feel, even in a place like this? None of it moves you? To be frank, I struggle to maintain even a wit of interest <laughs> in art. But Mr. Holmes, it is joy incarnate, mankind's greatest achievement. Mankind's highest achievement above all others is objective and rational thought. I see then why you dislike art, for it means whatever you want it to. Or perhaps, Mr. Vogel, I was lying. Aha, uh -huh. uh -huh. the case was trivial. Mr. Vogel, I have confirmed that the intruder was an average-sized, flexible, malpal smoker with a limp. As it happens, the vandalism was a cover. The true intent was to steal a painting without your knowledge. The fact is, one of the pieces from the wild room is not in the wreckage. What? That is extraordinary. Okay. Uh, the limping visitor. Okay. This thief was familiar with the gallery and he was sporting a limp. Yeah, ini ya. Pincang, guys. Do any of your clients Jaraknya or beda. artists Langkanya. come to mind? My. Your attention to detail is remarkable, Mr. Holmes. I should introduce you to Bosch's works. Alas, I'm afraid I cannot suggest a culprit. Okay, about the theft? The fire was a clever attempt to hide a stolen painting, even if it didn't fool me. I found the remnants of an empty frame in the pile of ashes. The canvas had been removed. Do you know which paintings in the wild room may have interested a thief? Were any particularly expensive? Those pieces belonged to a well-known artist named Boniface Mercurio. They're controversial, but not of a notably high value. Okay, about the break-in. The intruder entered the basement through the coal chute. He used a magnet to open the latch and dislodged the shovel while doing so. That's the noise you heard yesterday. When you went downstairs to investigate, he hid in the coffin. Hmm. The last thing, yeah? It seems I should have checked the space more thoroughly. There's something more, is there not? I can see it in your eyes. Hmm. Indeed. There is another intriguing angle. I recently received an anonymous offer for one of Mercurio's works. The sum was more than fair. And indeed, could have saved Mercurio from his artistic poverty. But he declined it. Was it a performative whim? Some artists lionize pain and hardship as if their work would be worse after a meal and a hot bath. I cannot tell. But not only did he refuse the deal, he insisted on displaying the painting in the public space. I was hoping to change his mind, but artists are a special breed of stubborn. Okay, di mana Mercurio tinggal? So where can I find Boniface Mercurio? I know he lives somewhere in Old City, but couldn't be more specific. He's a prominent figure, so finding him shouldn't be a problem. Okay, kita mau cari. What was depicted in the piece? Hmm, a bound woman wrapped in robes, being penetrated by a red devil that stared at us, the viewer. 
The beast had numerous tails growing from his back, and a large crowd gathered around the pair, silently watching the orgiastic scene. OK, well, given the nature of the other works on display, it's hard to see why that one stood out. What could possibly be its value? The evaluation of art is very subjective, Mr. Holmes. After all, art is everything. A poem, a bruise, the beads of sweat on your beloved skin. Even a masterfully solved crime. I'm not sure I see the connection. Regardless, the painting was one of a series called The Sabbath Night in Cordona. Oh. The works depict sex, violence and other controversial acts that life, for better or worse, contains. Ah, I see. I'm not sure that you do, but that can wait for another time. Well, I believe I have enough to begin. Thank you, Mr. Vogel. Your gallery certainly has unexpected depths. I'm delighted to have been able to please a friend. In return, I expect you to come back with good news. Or at least with a good story. Okay, kita bakal bantuin dia ya. Kita bakal cari dulu yang menggambar tuh lukisan dulu ya. Kita udah dapat key evidence-nya. Kita bakal ngecek lokasi dari orangnya. Dia ada di Old City. Jadi gue bakal coba cari tahu dulu. Kita bakal lihat casebook kita di sini ya. Oh, kita harus ngeliat. Oke. Okay. Kita harus tarik adresnya, oke, okay? atau alamatnya. Caranya gimana? Kita harus nyari lokasi yang bisa memberitahu kita tentang lokasinya. Apakah di Watchtower ini? Hmm, bukan pastinya. Kita coba ke sini kali teman ya. Gue penasaran sih. Di Cordona Chronicle. Ada tanda seru di sana teman-teman soalnya. Bisa jadi di situ. <laughs> soalnya ada tanda seru. Gue curiga di situ. Oke, okay, kita coba ya. Cordona Chronicle. Semoga benar ya guys ya. Mr. Holmes, I have something for you. Apa tuh? Coba ya. Oke, okay, bentar guys ya. Bisa gak sih? Periode sekarang teman ya. Recent people kayaknya dia celebrity kali ya. District di Old City. Oke, okay, kita coba ya. Oke, okay, berhasil teman ya. The Brawl at Artist Sell Out. Oh, ini mukanya teman ya. Tampaknya seperti ini. Oke. Okay. Oke, okay, kita bakal coba lihat aja ya. Ini dia. Adresnya... Di Hermes F between Scarlet Street dan Olive Street Oke, okay, di antara Scarlet dan Olive Street teman-teman ya Oke, okay, Scarlet Street Di mana ini? Oh, di sini teman-teman ya katanya ya Rumahnya di sekitar sini Kita bakal ke sini teman-teman ya Let's go Keluar dulu Semoga ketemu nih Si artis yang membuat lukisan mengerikan itu Oke, kita teleport sini ya guys ya. Let's go. Nice, nice. Seru sih ini game. Ya, seru tapi mesti banyak baca dan mikir. Gitu loh. Di sekitar jalan sini nih. Jalan sini nih. Ini kah? Bukan guys. Oh, ini nih kayaknya. Oh, bener, bener, bener. Excuse me, young man. Where do you think you're going? Greetings, ma'am. I'm looking for the... I don't care who you're looking for. You shall not pass. No visitors allowed. I wish to buy a painting from Mr. Boniface Mercurio. Is he at home? Deary, tell me because old age has made me blind. Did someone write information bureau on my forehead? Because I'm not here to answer your questions. Entry is for residents only. If you aren't a resident, please leave, or I shall report you to the police. Okay, kita malah mau dilaporin ke polisi. Apa juga guys ya? Oke, okay, kita mau dilaporin ke polisi. Oke, okay, berarti gua harus mau mengganti penampilan gua, guys ya. Oke, okay, gua nggak tahu harus mengganti penampilan seperti apa. Kita bakal ganti penampilan kita dulu kalau gitu. Kita bakal coba ganti penampilan kita sama seperti yang di foto ini kali, guys ya. Semoga ada sih jual semua. Don't miss out on the best. Don't miss out. Let's pick something that suits you. Oke, okay, let's pick something that suits you katanya. Oke. Okay. Um, gimana tadanya? Ini dia kita tampilannya teman. Cari baju yang mirip dengan dia. Oh, ini dia. Cete ke cete ke amat sangat badai. Wih sih, udah gue beli ya bajunya ya. Rambut. Wih sih ini teman ya rambutnya. Wih sih, rambut abang-abang ganteng, ya kan? Kemudian kumisnya, kumisnya kumis-kumis tipis guys ya. Yang ini apa yang ini ya? Oh, dia ada ada agak tebel di tengah ya kalau diperhatikan ya. Agak tebel enggak itu di tengah? Lebih mirip ini sih, ini kayaknya guys. Oh, ini ya. Wah, wow, artinya ada tanda. Ini artinya apa ya guys ya? Makeup ya, dia suruh gua agak tan ya, agak gelap ya guys ya kulitnya. 
Nah, udah mirip belum, guys? Wih, mirip ya. Choice. Wih, A ganteng choice kali. <laughs> Oke, kita balik lagi, guys. Kita bakal coba ke rumahnya dan ngelihat gimana respon dari yang jagain, teman-teman ya. Semoga dia percaya ya kalau gue itu adalah penghuni terakhir, petir. <laughs> penghuni dari uh, resident itu, teman-teman ya. Mirip belum kita sama yang uh, di foto ini, teman-teman. Ya. Oke, kita bakal coba masuk. Semoga berhasil. Masuk. Halo, Bu. Bonus, nah. sweetie. Is that you? Ah. Old age does terrible things to one's sight. Oh, okay. I didn't recognize you at first. How are you, Mom? I I'm ashamed to admit that I've lost my key. Do you have a spare? For heaven's sake! How many times will you lose that key of yours? Of course I have a spare. You artists all live in your own little world. Please, accept my thanks. I would rather accept your rent. You promised to pay me several weeks ago and I'm still waiting. I will pay you, I promise, very soon. You'd better do, my dear. Or else I'll just change the lock. And I won't fall for those cow eyes. <laughs> Kita dapat kunci untuk masuk ke dalam ke ruangan. Terima kasih, Nyonya. Eh, uh, kok gua nggak? Gimana caranya? Kuncinya di mana? Oh, lewat sini dodol garut. Itu pintu rumahnya, guys. Bukan ini. Bukan ini. Bukan ini. Flat 2, nomor 2, guys. Ini dia. Oke, kita sampai di ruangannya. Uh. What the hell dia sudah meninggal rupanya. Kasus baru. Oh my god. Kalau saya lihat di sini, dia dibunuh, teman-teman. Ngeri kali. Kita pura-pura jadi orang yang udah dibunuh lagi. Soft torso Judging muscle. by post-mortem rigidity, the body lay here for one or two days. Udah dua hari, temen ya. The wound is precise. It was inflicted by a razor or a knife. Wih. Ngeri. Ada darah di sini. Soaked in blood. It seems as if the puddle of blood was here before the rags. Ada pisau juga di sini. Barbuk. Could be the murder weapon. A normal kitchen knife. Oke, okay, kita dapat clue baru tentang kematian dari Mercurio. Seorang artis, apa ya bahasa Indonesia-nya? Seniman, teman-teman ya. Bukan kalau bule aktris ya, sama aktor ya, bukan artis ya. Kalau di Indonesia artis itu dianggap orang yang masuk TV itu dianggap artis semua, guys. <laughs> Agak susah dibedakan. Oke, okay. ada May banyak whiskey, whiskey. brandy box. Quite a collection he had here. Dia suka minum-minum. Ini ada koleksinya dia teman-teman. The chest has been searched. Oh, ada yang mencari lukisannya dia. Oh, gua tahu. Jadi orangnya itu mau ngambil lukisannya dia di rumah dia, tapi dia bilang nggak di gua, nggak di gua. Nah, akhirnya dia kayaknya bilang dibeli sama si Vogel. Jadi dia cari. Ini dia. Red skin, tails on the back, reminds me of Verda's description of the stolen painting. What? Ini. Oke. Okay. Aneh. Oke, ada satu di sini. The photograph was not pulled out in time. Ini kayak tempat Such apa ya? Uh, yeah. Look at this, John. Isn't it our stolen demon? Oke, okay, ada foto di sana. Mencurigakan sih ini. Oh, itu ada apa di situ? The photograph was not pulled out in time. Such a waste of material. Oke, okay, ada satu lagi di sini. Ada ada rokok, teman-teman ya. Oh, bukan fork. Knife is missing. Oke. Okay. Pecah itu terminnya. Oh, ada ada eh uh, ada cloth teman-teman ya. Ada kain di sana. Ada center di sana. Oh, itu wine gua kan center kocak. Ada kamera. I wonder where he got that fancy camera. Ada foto juga di sini. Oke, okay, ada koran. Despite the overall tendency towards mess, you cannot sit with the drawer pulled out like this. Oke, okay, ada yang mencari Someone sesuatu di sini ya. After searching. Ya. Mencurigakan, sepertinya ada seorang yang mencoba mencari sesuatu di dalam rumah ini, loh ya. Kaget gua ngeliat si bumbu pecel lagi ngapain di sini. Kita lihat teman-teman di sini. Mercurio flat. Oke, kita cari dulu ya informasi yang lebih detail lagi, guys. Kayaknya kita butuh info lebih lanjut nih. Oh ini di bawah, di bawah nih. 
Ada foto. The blood has dried. Udah kering. I've heard of this style of painting. It is called expressionism. Oke, okay, kita bakal coba mengilustrasikan lagi guys ya kasus yang satu ini. Menarik sekali kasus yang satu ini. Oke, okay, kita bakal lihat ya. Oh, masuk akal ini dipukul pakai itu ya. Karena Ha. Kebalik, kebalik. Nah, dia mukul pelakunya pakai pisau. Pisaunya nge tikam dia di sini. Gak mungkin, gak mungkin. Nah, ditikam sama dia ya. Kemudian itu mati ya. Kemudian di sini Tuh, 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 tuh. jadi aneh. Tapi ini paling masuk akal sih. Dia dari sini. Oh, jadi kebalik ya? Bentar guys, kita lihat dulu ya. Gue kok jadi bingung. Ini gak mungkin sih. Gini sih harusnya logika gue. paham. Nah, jadi dia pertama lagi nyuci foto, ada suara dia keluar, dia keluar dipukul sama dia, pelakunya melawan. Betul gak? Mercurio was developing photographs when the intruder snuck in. Betul guys, betul guys. Mercurio heard him coming. While the thief was searching the chest, the painter ran towards him with a bottle in his hand. He smashed it across the thief's head. The intruder had no choice but to defend himself, and the weapon of opportunity happened to be a kitchen knife. Okay. Mercurio stepped aside to grab the painting, but the wine-blinded thief attacked Mercurio's throat. Yeah. When the thief came to his senses, he saw Mercurio bleeding on the floor. He grabbed the rags and tried to bandage him, but it was too late. Okay. Why did Mercurio attempt to snatch the painting in the middle of a fight? To strike the intruder? Not with his painting, it was too important to him. Oke, okay, menarik teman ya. Kasus baru lagi kematian dari seorang artis atau seniman. Kita bakal coba melanjutkan di next episode. Semoga kita bisa segera mencahin kasus yang satu ini. Siapa yang membunuhnya? Siapa yang menginginkan uh, ininya ya lukisannya ya? Dan anehnya kenapa ada lukisan ini di sini gitu loh ya? Jadi semua kalian terhibur dengan episode kali ini. Sampai jumpa lagi di video berikutnya. Dadah.